Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm back with a haul. So I recently went away to the US and as a Canadian that always makes me go crazy. So I did buy some exciting things that I do want to share with you guys. And also if you're not subscribing, don't forget to hit the button down below. So I'm just going to jump right into the haul first. So the very first thing I got was actually from Kohl's and it is older but what a deal for this. So it's the Lorac Alter Ego Lipstick Collection. And this was originally $35, or $35 and it's $80 value. And I actually only paid $17.50 for it. So I'll probably do a video about this, but it came with Duchess, Seductress, Vixen, Vixen CEO, and Free Spirit. So one of these lipsticks alone is $17 at Ulta. So I was really pumped about this deal and I could not leave it. So I'm really excited to try these lipsticks. They're all such pretty colors. I didn't buy anything else at Kohl's. With the exchange rate, I try to be good and on my best behavior. Um, so I'll jump into, oh, actually, I got this at Kmart. I've always wanted to try these. It's the Giordana Sweet Cream Matte Liquid Lipstick and I got it in Creme Brulee. I've heard it is, um, a dupe for one of the Kylie lip kits and I did try it already and I really do like this color. It's really nice and uh, long lasting and it didn't dry my lips out. So I did go to Ulta and I got these Vegas Nay lashes and these are the Grand Glamour lashes. I did get some of the other ones last year and I really like them. I do find they are long lasting and these are just so glam and so pretty. I can't wait to try them on. I just, uh, I really like Vegas Nay and these lashes are awesome and they're pretty affordable. They were buy one, get one 50% off, but I didn't buy another pair. I know, I know. Um, the next thing I got was this Makeup Revolution Mermaid Palette. And I've always wanted to try Makeup Revolution products. I've heard really good things about them and they're not available in Canada and shipping to Canada can be kind of pricey. So I was excited to get this Mermaids Forever Palette because it's all shimmer. Um, eyeshadows and a lot of these colors I don't experiment with so I'm really excited to get that it was pretty cheap it was like $15 for this palette so I thought that was really good and I'll probably be doing a video on that I also got this makeup revolution blush I was given the recommendation from Samantha Jane YT I'll link her channel down below and she does a lot of videos about uh, kind of drugstore products and she told me to pick up one of these so I got this in Divine and it's really pretty. I will like it for summer. It was only like $5, so not a lot of money lost if it's not great. And I also did get my mom some dry shampoo for blondes, but I gave that to her already. I didn't go crazy at Ulta. Like I said, the dollar is not great and I didn't want to pay duty in exchange. I'll probably go down again soon. Um, the next things were from TJ Maxx. So I got this balloon kit. I really wanted these balloons for my birthday, but with the postal strike, I got um, really stressed out if I was gonna get them and stuff. So I thought I would get this for next year. So it says happy bee day. And it's just these gold balloons. I'm really excited. I can always use them for like a girlfriend's birthday. And uh, they were only $5. So that was a really good deal because they're not that cheap at all online. Uh, what else did I get from TJ Maxx? I can't even think. I think that may have been it. Um, I went to Burlington Coat Factory and I got this, which is the Sonic Facial Cleansing Massager. And this was actually only $3.99 regularly, $12.99. But why I got it is it looks like those Brio, um Lunas, the mini ones. So I thought that was a good deal because if I got this for $3.99 and that one's like $100, that's just crazy. If it doesn't work, I only paid $3.99 for it. So I was super excited about this. Hopefully it will work really well with my skin. Um, oh, I also got this at Ulta getting back. It is the birthday gift and it's the Urban Decay eyeshadow in Midnight Cowboy. It's really pretty. Um, right here you could almost use it as a highlighter too I think it'd be really good for that not just an eyeshadow so I it's $19 value so I was happy I got my birthday gift 
Um, I went to Marshalls, didn't really go crazy there. Bought these cute um, underwear for a dollar, they were on sale. Got a pink pair. So I was really happy about that. Um, also, I did get this at Burlington Coat Factory, which is really cute. It is lipstick is a girl's best friend and it has a lipstick here. I'm addicted to cute little mugs and I could not pass up on this one because it's just so cute and so different. I've never seen anything like that. Sorry, this haul is all over the place. I thought I had everything organized, but I guess I do not, or I guess I do not. So I went to Target, didn't really go crazy in Target. I always feel bad. I was shopping with my boyfriend. I didn't want to make him wait too much. It was kind of like our first um, shopping trip where he could see how crazy I go when I go shopping. So I didn't want to make him wait too much, but we went to Target. I got these really cute LED lights for only $3. They are like mint and pink. So I thought they were super cute and um, they'll be really nice for my videos. I'll probably hang them in the back. Also at Target, I got this washi tape and it's three of them. It said $3, but when I looked on my receipt, I somehow only paid 30 cents. Uh, I just found it in the dollar spot and grabbed it. So I don't know what's up with that. I'm not complaining, 10 cents a washi strip. That's pretty amazing. And I also got something I've been looking for eternally. And it is this. I thought this was super cute. I'm gonna put it in my room. Everybody's been putting these on their Instagram and I just think this is the cutest thing ever. It was only $7.99 and I'm so happy that I got it because I know it was sold out at a lot of places. And actually, I don't really have too much stuff left. I got these at the Dollar Tree, so they're those really cute wet and wild blush or brushes. So this is the crease brush and this is a large concealer brush, but you can kind of use it for whatever you want. So that was some of the things that I got on my trip. I actually didn't buy any clothes. There wasn't really anything that caught my eye. And like I said, I didn't want to go crazy with the exchange rate, but I hope you guys enjoyed my video. And if you're not subscribing, don't forget to hit the button down below and also like this video and let me know what you guys thought. So thank you so much for watching and enjoy the rest of your day.